Tracy from the Vinnie Stamps. We're going to be using the 4 inch round gel press and we're going to use our elements as a base and then we're going to sprinkle some brush out. So first of all I'm going to transfer that ink onto the gel press and it doesn't look like there's a, a lot going on at all but it's a great base for brush -os. Now I'm going to use the fan brush and I'm going to pick up some yellow. This is really watered down brush -os. I always water them down a lot to get this effect. And now I'm going to use a little bit of the moss green and some purple as well. So you only need a couple of colours. If you put too many colours on it can go very muddy. So we've got our white multifarious card here and I'm going to pop that over the top and just smooth it over. And there's your background. So you can see by just using three colours you get that lovely organic effect. I'm going to trim that down. So we've got one of our new trees here and I'm going to ink this up now in Nocturne. And I'm going to just pop that along the edge like so. Okay, give that a good press down. And there it is. So I'm going to colour the tree in a little. So I'm going back to the olive green and I'm just painting the trunk of the tree and because we've already stamped in the Versafine Claire which is an oil based ink it means we can paint over the top and it won't budge Okay, let's just dry that off a little. And we've got two little hairs here. And this time I'm going to ink up in the twilight. I'm just popping one next to the other. Okay, so I've got a verse here and I'm going to just pop the verse around the edge. So what colour shall we use? Um, actually, I might stick with the twilight.
and I've got a little foliage stamp here that I'm using just to create some little leaves falling down. Now taking the twilight again I'm just going to use my stencil brush and I'm just going to sweep over the edge. nice and quick and easy and that just gives it a really nice sort of hue around the edge and it pulls your eye into the centre there okay so let's have a look we've got Posca pen here and all I'm going to do is just put a few tiny dots coming down from the tree now I've used yellow, but you can use any colour you like. And it's all these light little elements that really do add the detail to the card. which look very effective. So lastly, I'm going to use the glue pen now and I'm going to follow the dots that I've just put down, but not as many. Just a few. And then I'm going to sprinkle some glitter over the top just to give it a little bit of magic. Let's go with the fairy tales. And you can see that lovely sparkle coming down from the trees. So another really quick, easy card. The gel press is a great product, you know, it just, it takes that sort of blank card away from you. It gives you a starting point. Well, I hope that you enjoyed today's demo, guys. Thanks so much for joining me again. Bye for now.